guys, it's your girl Brianna, aka Mini Marley, and I'm back with another video. This one is going to be about how I style sporty outfits. So in the past, I've done Fabletics hauls and shown you guys all of the pieces that I get. I just try them on, talk about them, and that's it. But because I wear these pieces so often and I literally wear them as casual looks sometimes, I wanted to show you guys how I transform these basic pieces and add accessories, different shoes, the sporty bags, and create casual looks. These outfits are not just for working out or going to the gym. You can definitely wear them on the go and I'm going to show you guys how I make these really cute. So if you want to see how I style these pieces, then keep watching this video. All right, so for this first look, we're gonna keep it basic. This is just a basic pair of Fabletics leggings and a Fabletics top. It's really nice and stretchy and comfortable, really breathable, which I like. And this is just one of those sets that you need to have in your collection. Super basic and easy, but I kind of love the basic pieces because you can add a lot to it, spice it up, make it look cute. So as you can see, I have on this, I think they're called like herringbone chains and it's pretty nice and thick. And then for the rest of my jewelry, it's just my basic stuff, my ring, my bracelet, and I have on some hoop earrings. And again, I will link all the jewelry for you in the description box below. This top is actually padded, so you don't have to wear a bra with it if you don't want to. I do have on a bra with mine and then again we just have some plain black leggings so for this look I'm going pretty sporty with these shoes right here these high tops and I love these I don't get to wear them that often but I think that they are perfect for this look so I feel like these shoes give this look a more urban street style type of feel versus gym wear and then I'm going to take it up a notch by adding this crossbody or fanny pack bag whatever you guys like to call it I literally wear this all the time because it's just so easy and convenient. I don't have to have anything in my hand. So I love it and I like to wear it across like this. It just adds a little bit of style to the look and bam. If you're not into wearing it across the chest, you can also tighten it and wear it like this, like an actual fanny pack, which is really cool. This is a nice versatile little bag and it holds a lot of stuff. Like, I'm giving you guys urban streetwear. This is not gym wear at all. So that's why I love these pieces because you can definitely change it up and take it in whatever direction you want to. So yeah, this is the first look. All right, so this next outfit is a little bit different for me because I personally hate joggers most of the time. I feel like they have a lot of extra fabric in the crotch area and it's just not a good look for me. I feel like it makes me look bigger than I am. So ugh, I typically hate joggers, but these actually fit really, really nice. I love that they don't have too much extra fabric. They're nice and high waisted if you want them to be, of course, and they just feel really good. They're really nice material. I love the pockets. The color is super cute. These are a nice burgundy on the bottom. And then the top has some red and burgundy and it actually has a pop of blue in the back. And I really, really like the way that this looks. To spice this look up, I added a pair of white sneakers and I feel like it just looks really cute and casual. You could definitely make this even more casual with a nice denim jacket, but I'm going to spice up this look with another Fabletics piece. This is also very much out of my comfort zone, but I thought that it was really cute. I love when girls wear those little crop tops that go over and then they have a bralette or something like this underneath. And Fabletics actually sent me one this month. So let me try this on for you guys and show you what it looks like. <laughs> All right, so I added the top. It has these little thumb holes right here and this just completely changes everything I feel like. I feel like I'm giving very much Sierra one, two step. Like, I don't know. I feel like I should know how to do some dance moves in this outfit, but <laughs> this is really different for me. Like I said, but I think it's cute. And I feel like because I have this up here and you know the neckline is kind of exposed, I would be pretty extra with my jewelry. I honestly get ready first and then I add my jewelry depending on how extra I'm trying to be. So let's see. So for this look, I'll probably layer a couple different necklaces. And then I'm also going to add my nameplate and year necklace. So with the jewelry on, I feel like that just adds a whole another element to it and it makes it really cute. The neckline is already really interesting and this just is some added detail to spice it up a little bit. But yeah, this is the finished look. I think that this is so cute and again, so different for me. 
but I'm here for it. I love the sporty vibes. I think that it's really nice. These types of tops are in, so don't sleep on Fabletics. I can't believe this whole outfit is from them. I definitely want some more of these joggers because they're so comfortable and they actually fit right. You guys know what I mean when you get that pouch right here. It's the worst. It's not flattering, not cute, but these are really really nice let me know what you guys think what is this look giving it is just i can't get sierra one two step out of my head like i just feel like it's very like break dance like i don't even know but let me know what you guys think of this look in the comments below all right let's go to the next one this is a two-piece set that is really cute. This one is actually different. I've never had a pair of leggings from Fabletics that has a waistband like this. This is kind of like a sweater knitted type of material, but it's really thick and it really pulls you in. As you can see, I honestly do not have hips. I have hip dips, but this kind of creates some hips. I'm feeling it. Like I love a good snatch in the midsection. So this really does that for me. And it's also a layered tank top in the sports bra, which is pretty cool. And it's like a nice burgundy color with some red. So of course this could be your basic gym look, but you can also spice it up a little bit. As you can see for my jewelry, I put on two of my chains that I like to layer together. And it's basically just a cross and then like a chain link necklace. I have my everyday bracelet and rings on. And then for the shoes, I'm going to be wearing these. I have a brand new white pair. So this is what the outfit looks like with the shoes. I think that it looks really cute and casual. And I'm so annoyed because I just lost my denim jacket. I left it somewhere. But the perfect way to complete this look would definitely be to just throw on an oversized denim jacket to give you a little bit more coverage and make it look casual and cute, you know, pull the sleeves up a little bit. I'm so annoyed. I literally just lost this jacket. It would have been perfect. Perfect. But this just gives you an idea how that would look. I think that this would look really cute with a denim jacket thrown over. Actually put it on, but an oversized one. Push up the sleeves a little bit. I think that would really complete the look. It will make it really a casual, chill, something that you can just run out in that's nice and cute and not necessarily just for the gym. But yeah, hopefully you guys kind of get the idea. I need to get a new oversized denim jacket because I lost my other one, but I think this would be really cute. All right, so here is the next outfit and don't say anything yet. I know it looks a little bit crazy. I really wanted to wear these shoes with it, but now that I see it on, it doesn't really match that well. So I have another idea, but before I change into that, I just wanted to show you guys these shorts. This is another set that I got and these two came together, but I think that I personally would switch it up. This sweater is really, really cool though. It has a big zipper in the back and I feel like it's pretty much reversible. You can wear it the other way around with the zipper in the front, put it all the way open and have it open and just kind of you know really cute or you can wear it like this with the thumb holes you can take the thumb holes out scrunch up the jacket a little bit and yeah but i have another idea for this hold on one second all right so i switched it up threw on my favorite pair of black fabletic shorts instead of those blue one made this sweater a little bit more slouchy and i switched it around and opened it in the front like i was saying you can do I know it's still summertime, especially here in Miami, it's pretty much always summertime, but if it gets really cold where you live, then you're probably already getting some transitional pieces as we head towards fall. So this is really nice and warm. If you're into biker shorts, I definitely recommend these by Fabletics. They just are so nice and comfortable and nice and thick. I like a good quality thick material, not something that you can see through. And as you can see, you definitely cannot see through these that's pretty much the look i added this bag again sometimes i just like to throw it over my shoulder like this so it's really nice and effortless and that's pretty much it all right so last but definitely not least is this little pink and burgundy outfit right here i really love this one because as you guys know if you watch my last two fabletic hauls i personally love these little halter tops i have it in three colors well this is my fourth one and i just think that they're so cute and feminine and they just 
they give me good energy good vibes i don't know what it is but i really really like this top this is pretty much how i would normally go out on a regular day i don't always dress up the looks and do too much i just like to have my jewelry looking cute i put on some slides if i'm just running around and i just wear something simple like this so this is a pair of fabletics leggings of course this is in a nice light mauve type of pink color and it has this gray kind of piping around the sides and a little bit of red and then of course we have the halter top so it is open in the back like this and yeah i just really really love these tops for this like i said i probably wouldn't wear sneakers i would just wear some slides like these ones but you could also pair it with some white sneakers like the ones i showed you in this video and that would be cute as well if you prefer that if you're running around all day and that's more comfortable for me slides are most comfortable so i wear them a lot and these match perfectly with these leggings so that's why i put them together and then of course you can just pair this with whatever your everyday bag is i like this one right now because it's nice and neutral i feel like it goes with the mauve type of tones that we have right here it's giving neutral and earth tone so so yeah like i said this is my everyday type of look for sure i also love that these leggings have this kind of tummy control band right here it has like an extra thick kind of waistband that you can hear how you know tight and thick it is and i think that that is really useful you guys know i love that kind of stuff and a lot of you guys messaged me in the comments saying that you like the fact that i'm able to wear these clothes and i don't have the cookie cutter or body i definitely think that fabletics is good for that it's really just good for all body shapes and types i like that they don't just create clothes for one type of person or one look i see it so many girls of so many different shapes and sizes wearing fabletics which is amazing so definitely check them out if you haven't already don't forget to sign up to become a vip member because that is how you're going to get the best deals you're going to get exclusive pricing you're going to be able to earn points towards getting free stuff and you'll also get two leggings for 24 dollars when you sign up but yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed this styling type of video i know it's a little bit different than normal i was trying something new talking to the camera showing you guys a little bit of my jewelry my bags my shoes and how i create looks around some of these pieces i know i promised that i was going to do a try on haul showing everything i bought during quarantine and that is definitely still coming i was just waiting to buy two more things that i have been wanting for a long time including this bag but i'm not going to talk too much about it now because that try on haul is still coming up soon definitely look out for it before the end of this month and if you have not already turn on your notifications i feel like people are not getting notified about my videos so if you're watching this and you don't have notifications on definitely turn those on and make sure that you are subscribed to my channel because i'm trying to keep the content coming i hope that you guys are enjoying these videos and i will see you in my next one peace out